that we're doing this internationally. Uh, it's a huge technical accomplishment, uh, but I think the fact that uh, we are overcoming these uh, cultural obstacles and bringing these people together uh, with this common goal I think is one of the most significant aspects of the International Space Station. I believe that uh, human beings uh, should expand into space. By uh, doing that, we can learn about ourselves and uh, make uh, the society and the world better. By working uh, together in a cooperative uh, way, uh, we can bring the world uh, closer together. This is a great opportunity for, for Japan and other countries to be able to participate in a space program like the ISS. NASA labs are the pride of the world for things that we can do, uh, where science and engineers meet together and say, let's do the impossible and, uh, and, and we'll do it. Our space projects are very demanding. A person has to work uh, maybe night and day and weekends so when the schedule requires it to finish something on time. We feel, I feel, that the entire world is watching us and waiting for us to do our thing and to get it right. And it's a tremendous opportunity, it's also a tremendous responsibility. And uh, it's always been pretty clear that we do this together as teams, and that uh, it's the only way you could possibly do these amazing projects. So I think we can be very proud of what we've accomplished. We look back in history and, and we think uh, this country was founded in part by a, a scientist, uh, Ben Franklin, uh, and a, a future president Thomas Jefferson who was very fond of science and so they would be so proud and thrilled to see what our country has accomplished with science and, and the uh, engineering miracles that have happened in consequence uh, I think they never would have guessed but they would still be thrilled to see what's been done. As NASA enters its sixth decade it's time to go back to the moon. This time we'll go back not just for a few hours not for a few days but for good, for the good of exploration, innovation, and inspiration, for the good of humanity. We will give NASA a new focus and vision for future exploration, to gain a new foothold on the moon, and to prepare for new journeys to the worlds beyond our own. We, as a civilization, must explore. That's who we are. Intrinsically, that's who the human race is. We're explorers. And unless we continue to explore, we're going to falter as a civilization. When we cease to be an exploring nation, when we cease to seek knowledge and ask questions, that's the time we will wither and dive on, on this planet. I think it's significantly important that we look to the future. Mars, of course, will be the next outpost. I think we'll have people uh, living on Mars 50 years from now. What they'll be looking forward to, uh, I have no idea, but I'm sure it'll be uh, fascinating. I'd like to see the, the mission to Mars be accomplished. It's something I did some work on in making the proposal we made. I think there's a consensus that going to Mars is a worthy objective, and I'd like to see that accomplished. Perhaps at one time in the distant past, the, at least some basic life forms existed on Mars and perhaps could again in the future. These things mean a lot to me. I think space is important, and I think America should continue to be in the forefront of space exploration. No matter where you go in the world, people know what the letters N-A-S-A -S -A stand for. They say NASA, and they say it with recognition. That in and of itself tells you that NASA stands for something in the world, not just in America, but across the world. Throughout all human history, we've, we've always had people look up and think, you know, the blue sky, what is it up there? Gee, you wonder what it would be like if we could go up there. In our time, our lifetimes, we've gone up there. You know, here we are and developed that kind of a capability in our time. What a great time to be alive. 
The future of mankind depends upon space travel. If we stay on Earth, we'll go on having wars. But if we go to the moon and Mars, we'll bind ourselves together into one single race, one color, and go into space and live forever. Okay, I'm coming over. You look beautiful. I feel like a million dollars.